Hi, this is Bob Holcomb from Apex Automotive in Great Barrington, Massachusetts for Demand Studios. We're going to look at an ABS braking system or analog brakes. This device right here is the heart of the braking system. It incorporates an electric motor, ABS accumulator pump, ABS accumulator, distribution block, ABS control module or ECM or ABS ECM. Its job is to interpret inputs from the driver and then send braking to each wheel individually so that your car does not skid. If one of the wheels should not spin while the car is in motion and the brake is applied, this device will make thousands of computations a second to make sure that those wheels continue to spin so that your car still has stability and you're able to steer out of harm's way. Some of the most common problems with the ABS brake system are the wheel speed sensors. As they're in a very hostile environment, down by the braking system where there's a lot of heat generated and also there's a lot of debris that can come in contact with the ABS wheel speed sensors or wheel speed rings. This device is under tremendous pressure. It's an accumulator that builds hydraulic pressure over and over, back and forth. There's a series of springs, valves, electronic solenoids in your ABS system. This device is diagnosed through a laptop computer or a factory scan tool. The ABS system also incorporates many of the standard braking components. Your brake pads, rotors, calipers, wheel cylinders, shoes and drums. The ABS system could be the culprit if one of those systems should fail. Whenever working on or repairing a car with an ABS system, you want to use extreme caution as there is many hundreds of pounds of hydraulic pressure built up in the system. This needs to be released and is probably best left to the experts. This is Bob Holcomb from Apex Automotive in Great Barrington, Massachusetts for Demand Studios.